the Reserve Bank of India came into existence on 1st of April 1935 as a joint stock company. It was nationalized in 1949. Over the last nine decades, through its multifarious functions, the RBI has played a crucial role in the development of Indian financial sector and the economy. As the currency issuer of the country, the RBI has ensured supply of good quality banknotes. It has achieved near self-sufficiency in printing and sourcing of security features of banknotes by setting up of currency printing presses, paper manufacturing units and in-house ink factory. Being the banker and debt manager to the central and state governments, the Reserve Bank has managed their market borrowing programs and facilitated development of the government securities market. Introduction of new instruments, strengthening market infrastructure and expanding the participant base including retail investors have ensured deepening of financial markets. India's monetary policy framework has evolved from monetary targeting to flexible inflation targeting which was introduced in 2016. This was a major structural reform and has fostered price stability. RBI's monetary policy decisions are backed by its robust research and data analysis. The Reserve Bank is also responsible for the country's foreign exchange and reserves management. Its role has evolved over the years from being a regulator to a facilitator in an environment of market-determined exchange rates. A number of measures have been taken to simplify foreign exchange regulations for facilitating investment and trade. As the regulator and supervisor of a large part of the financial sector, the RBI has played a crucial role in promoting a sound and efficient financial system in the country. The regulatory and supervisory architecture of the financial system has been comprehensively restructured in the recent years. As a part of its commitment to financial inclusion, the Reserve Bank's policy on priority sector lending and many other measures has channelized credit to the needy sectors of the economy. This has given a strong fillip to financial inclusion. To strengthen customer protection and grievance redress mechanisms, the scope of Banking Ombudsman Scheme has been gradually widened. The Reserve Bank Integrated Ombudsman Scheme embodies the One Nation, One Ombudsman approach. India now has state-of-the-art payment systems that are affordable, accessible, convenient, safe and secure. The country has acquired a leadership position in digital payments landscape. As a regulator of the payment system, the RBI has played a significant role on making this possible. As part of promoting responsible innovations in financial services, the regulatory sandbox of the Reserve Bank provides a platform for developing solutions with focus on innovation and research in the fintech space. Giving further fillip to innovation, the RBI has taken a pioneering role among central banks by introducing the digital rupee, the central bank digital currency in 2022 as a pilot project. The RBI has also been an institution builder in niche areas of the financial services sector. In its 90 years journey, the Reserve Bank has navigated through turbulent times with commitment and determination. This was prominently visible during the COVID-19 pandemic and the war in Ukraine. India's financial system and the economy have emerged stronger from these unprecedented global shocks. As we commemorate 90 years of the RBI, we rededicate ourselves to building a robust financial system that is future-ready and contributes to the well-being of our country and the people. <laughs>